गाइज व्हाट्सअप एंड एज यू नो डैर सैमसंग इज हैविंग एन अनपैक्ड इवेंट इन सैन फ्रांसिस्को ऑन फेब्रवरी ट्वेंटी एंड वी एक्सपेक्ट टू सी एट लीस्ट थ्री न्यू फोन इंक्लूडिंग द सैमसंग गैलेक्सी एस टेन प्लस विद फोर कैमराज ऑन द बैक एंड टू ऑन द फ्रंट इन ए पंच होल ऑन द इन्फिनिटी ओ डिस्प्ले हैविंग सेट डैर देर माइट बी मोर देन ए मंथ टू द ऑफिशियल लॉन्च डेट of the S10 plus but the Samsung Galaxy S10 plus already appeared in a live photo yeah guys this is the actual first ever look of the Samsung Galaxy S10 plus this picture is taken on the damn bus and look at that this device looks futuristic the rumors are true and there will be two selfie cameras tucked in the upper right corner while bezels looks like they are getting even thinner than the Samsung Galaxy S9 plus from the last year so the poster confirmed this is the Samsung Galaxy S10 plus with a flip cover but the user removed the watermark on the screen with the employee id the device is still in its pre production case that is used to hide the design until the very last moment the phone is rapidly lighter than the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 despite the being same size the hole on the top is obviously noticeable although he couldn't probably try gaming or video watching due to the watermark across the screen therefore he can't share any thoughts on that issue there is a fingerprint scanner under the display but aside from these two technologies the differences from last year's flagship aren't huge and guys also we have a news regarding to the ultrasonic fingerprint scanner of the Samsung Galaxy S10 and the S10 Plus so ahead of the launch of the Samsung Galaxy S10 a screen protector making company has been working hard in order to ensure that the early availability of the cases for the S10 series however while performing test with the S10 it has found that the in display fingerprint scanner of the smartphone series does not support the screen protector the views regarding the same came out as a tweet from the company where the case maker also said that the vanguard cases will not come with in built screen protector they said we have tested our cases on real galaxy s10 phones the in screen fingerprint scanner does not support screen protector having said that there is no response from samsung owning to the trouble discovered during the test of the ultrasonic display and it would be impossible to consider in any way so yeah guys what's your thoughts on this let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and i'll catch you in the next one peace out